message of comfort to you. Comfort, yes, comfort my people, says your God. Grace and peace be multiplied to you in the knowledge of God and of Jesus our Lord. Do not be afraid, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy. Let not your heart be troubled, for the Lord your God has blessed you in all the work of your hand. He knows you're trudging through this great wilderness. The kingdom of heaven suffers violence, and the violent take it by force. Many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord delivers him out of them all. The Lord redeems the soul of his servants, and none of those who trust in him shall be condemned. Have you not known? Have you not heard? The everlasting God, the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, neither faints nor is weary. His understanding is unsearchable. He gives power to the weak, and to those who have no might, he increases strength. Even the youth shall faint and be weary, and the young men shall utterly fall. But those who wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. For I know the thoughts that I think toward you, says the Lord. Thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you a future and a hope. And all these blessings shall come upon you and overtake you, because you obey the voice of the Lord your God. Blessed shall you be in the city, and blessed shall you be in the country. God will make you abound in all the work of your hand, and my God shall supply all your need according to his riches and glory by Christ Jesus. Now to him who is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that we ask or think, according to the power that works in us. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Now to him who is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy. To God our Savior, who alone is wise, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, for thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever, both now and forever.